You all must have heard what happened between me and those rascally dickheads who call themselves my council of elders. They became extremely disrespectful and I had to fire them all. I'm sorry if any of you is a wife to them, but they got what they deserved. Now, if anyone has to work with me, that person has to be dedicated and satisfy me. I have looked around carefully and I have chosen the people I want to work with and you are the chosen ones. <laughs> you have demonstrated unquestionable loyalty and allegiance to me and I'm going to reward you all for that. So, from now on, you all are going to become my council of elders. <laughs> so, I'm going to start by first of all donning on you your symbol of authority. Chai! But we'll start first of all by changing your names. We're going to give you new names by which you will be called. Okay. What's your name? Nelma. Nelma. Mm -hmm. All right. From today, you will be called Sexy Mama. Hey, Sexy, sexy Mama. mama. Oh, <laughs> yes. What be fun? That's right. Hey. Mm -mm. Hey. Hey! Well, Alright. As for you, you will be called Bootelicious Mama. <laughs> You're my Bootelicious Mama from now on. <laughs> Butulicious. Butulicious. Hey. Oh, man. That's my Butulicious mama. <laughs> Butulicious. <laughs> you will be called Sugar Baby. Hey. Sugar. Sugar. Oh. Sugar. oh. You are chocolate mama. Thank you. <laughs> That's my chocolate mama. Yes. You are mm. Mm. Mm -mm. you are booby mama. <laughs> 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 Let's open it up.
So you all constitute the team that will form my advisory council. Hey. And along with me, we're going to rule this kingdom together. Hey. Well, I'm gonna let mom, mom, man. Hey. Whatever we decide is what is going to happen in this land. Hey. And everybody must owe allegiance to Big David O. Big David O. <laughs> Say it again. Big David O. That's the A team. I hear you. <laughs> hey. How could he have done such a thing to us? Eh? Um, um, wise one, please save us from this calamity. Help us beg the gods. Can you imagine? Our wives now put on a red cap. Ah! Aru. Wise one, David has finished us. Biko, mouthpiece of the gods. Something has to be done and very fast. Our youths now behave the way they want because there is no law and order anymore. Our lands have been sold by that evil son of his. Mm. Please, wise one, help us. Please. Both father and son are evil. Mm. In fact, they are demons in human form. Mm. Because the father knows exactly what the son does. Mm. I, I can't believe we inflicted this pain on ourselves. I can't believe it. We thought we were doing the right thing. Yes, we thought we were doing the right thing. But, ahem, wise one, I thought you said you were going to the palace to see him. Didn't you? I did. He refused to hear me. He pushed me out of his palace. Hey. He pushed you out? Hey! hey. David's madness has gone official. Ah! Hey. Ah! Pushed you out! Mm. I have already complained to the gods. And I know soon they will survey the situation. Their silence is never in vain. I can never stop making noise. Stop making noise. noise. Stop making noise. Mama, I don't make noise. noise. You of all people, Mama, I cannot believe this. You have no shame, <laughs> no respect. <laughs> Mama, hey, you, you, no, I just cannot believe this. Mama, you insulting me by accepting such a position from so, a, a demented man. Uh -huh. He's demented, eh? Uh -huh. You that is not demented. What have you been able to achieve? Uh -huh. I'm asking you, you, my friend, you should be thanking me. I should be thanking you? Yes. For what? For what? <laughs> you don't know what you should be thanking for. Well, I don't know. I have been able to save this family from <laughs> poverty. Something you've not been able to do as a man. <gasps> yes! Mama, I should thank you mm -hmm. for sharing in abomination. Um, eh? That is how you save this family. You, you sharing in abomination has saved this family of where? My dear. Listen to me. Soon, money will start coming. Yeah. <laughs> Food will start coming. Yeah. And you know what? <laughs> Big David promised to buy me a car. Hey. <laughs> no, See, ma I trust him all like you that he will fulfill everything he has said to me. No, ma. <laughs> Yeah. You sold yourself so cheap to that madman. <laughs> Look at you, red cow. What do you know about red cow? Ah! What is the meaning of a red cow? Ah! You are a woman! Woman! That's what you are! Okay, you that is the man. You that know what is a red cow. What have you achieved? 
And ask him, what have you achieved? What have you achieved? Eh? I have been able to do what you cannot do. Mm. Useless man. Look at this grain hair you have is for nothing. Absolutely nothing. You had better join the winning team and start ripping. You see, I made the right decision and it has earned me a member of the cabinet in the Igwe Palace. As a matter of fact, my position in this community has been elevated. Mr. Redcap, my foot. Let me tell you, Norma, look at me. You I'm cannot do your cabinet nonsense in this my house. Yeah. Yes! Eh? Mm. <laughs> this house. Where's the house? This one. This house. Listen, if you make too much noise in my ear, as a matter of fact, I will just go in and pack. There's nothing to pack anyway. You see all these racks? If you just talk too much, I will just walk away from here and go straight to the palace and begin to live with the Igwe. Because that is where people like me belong. Hey! Where I belong. Oh, go, go, go! Why are you making noise? Yeah, no! Come! Hey! Why are you making noise? Hey! Mama! What, what is it? Mama, you have no sh- uh -huh. You should have said so! So this has been your plan all along. Uh -huh. It is not your say what's on your mind. You are just jealous. In the last she won't give me. Listen to me. Don't even know. Oh, I can't remember. Do you know my new name? Uh oh! King David calls me. Sassy mama. <laughs> Sassy mama. It's a Sassy mama. Sassy, sassy, mama. sassy. Are you alright? <laughs> oh, I want to make a famo for sassy mama. Sassy mama. Hey, hey. Oh, yeah, him, there we were. Yeah, we're going, we're going. Aso kaso wampi ya bikosu boya Ay am the nire ya bikosu boya Mama you will regret this You will regret it I promise you It's not sexy mama Hey Mama Mama, Papa is right. See, you have no reason to accept that shameful position the Igwe offered. Damn, Chion. Shut up. I know you support him. No, oh, Mama, it's not about me supporting him. It's not about me supporting him, oh. I mean, I at least expected you to take sides with the Igwe. That man is mad. And he has turned everything everything upside down since he ascended the throne. I mean, why work with such a person? Dachid, I've always known you have your father's brain. Do you know what this family stands to gain from me being a member of the cabinet? Eh? What do we stand to gain? No, 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 Mama, tell me, what do we stand to gain? When you were not a member of the Igwe's cabinet, have we not been eaten in this house? Did we die? Hi. Chide. That at your age, what you think about is just food. You're just like your father. Don't you consider the monetary gains? Eh? Look at you. At your age, you have nothing meaningful to do. Yet you stand here Mama. to... Mama. Mama, you are diverting the topic. Yes, so because you're not different from your father. No ambition. It's so sad you're my only son. What your father only thinks about is how to provide food for the for the family. That's all. He doesn't aim higher. Well, I told him not to turn against the Igwe, but he refused. So can he hand him? I hear you. I hear you, Mama. We don't have ambition. We don't aim higher. We are good for nothing. But you see, these two good for nothing men, they still remain your husband and your son. 
But you see this topic you just raised? It's for another day. Mind you, Mama. But you see this position? That the ego of fat you, you accepted. You are dropping it. And I will make sure you do that. Then get ready to take the princess back to the palace. Because I, Chief Akuna Obuka, the daughter of Obijia, will not accommodate her in my house anymore. Thank you. Son, what's up, Dad? What's up? I'm good. I checked your room this morning, but you had gone out. Yes, Dad. I went out with my friends for a walk out. Yeah. Oh, I see. <laughs> well, meet my new team. I call them my allies. Wow. Whoa. Hi, new team. Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> anyway, they fit you because you're a great, great, generous king. That's right. You can say that again. Well, will you go and tell the maidens to fix up a decent meal for my team? Why not? Sure. sure. Let's All go. Right. Guys, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> wow. You have a wonderful son, my king. You can say that again. <laughs> I'm proud of him. Yeah. <laughs> we are going to have a party today. You're going to have a party with Big David Doe. Hey, hey! Can they be a bad man? Can one year on your own? I'm going to have a party with Big David Doe. Hey, hey! Can they be a bad man? I want to talk to you. Come here, I'm not. Oh, your father, your mother, 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 Nah, eh, Ibo I don't pan. Listen, stay here. I'm not going to go in there. I'm not going to go in there. In my own house. In my own house. Shut up. 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 Let it rain and I will send millions of thunder and lightning over your roof. It is a thunder that will blast your head. I've been telling you, it is not by height. Oh. It is not by height. I'm stopping this fucker from coming. David, how disrespectful can you get? Oh, I remember you. You're one of those jackasses I've fired recently. David, or whatever you call yourself, I don't know what you're doing with my wife making her a cabinet member. But you have to stop. Let her be. She's married. Nigga, do you realize you're speaking to your king? Are you conscious? Or are you high on dope or something? I've warned you. Stay away from my wife. She will not share in your madness. Bitch is still ranting. David, you must be out of your mind. You must be crazy. You are mad. Stop this madness before you get yourself consumed by it. If you don't get away from here now, I'll piss on you. Come on, you head. Come on, you head. Be careful. <laughs> Too many jackasses and douchebags in this kingdom. They, they're just driving me crazy. <laughs> Dad, don't mind them. Anyway, Dad, um, have you had the time to wonder where the princess may have gone? Oh, I was meaning to ask you that yesterday. Where is she? I don't know. But I know she has no right to leave this palace without your concept. Anyway, I think I'll call the guards to... send the guards to look for her right away. Okay. Guards! Guards! Oh, damn. Guards! I'm 
not happy the way my mother associates with that mad uncle of yours. Stop it. Don't ever call that man my uncle again. <laughs> He's not my uncle. That man is a beast. I regret ever having such a man as my uncle. Yeah. Um, Chidi, your mother is so stubborn. She doesn't listen to you or your father. Ah, <sighs> and that is the most annoying part of it. She won't listen. Yeah, you just have to let her be. I believe someday she'll realize that the path she's taking is dangerous. And I hope it will not be too late for her. I hope so too. Chidi, yes. I want to say thank you for all you've been doing for me. You've indeed made me happy in life again. I just pray it lasts. Why won't it last? What can I do for you? We have orders to bring the princess to the palace immediately. No! You are not taking her nowhere! You are I not taking her to the palace! Her. What was going on How there? How dare you question the king's order? My lord, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You can't stop them all alone. You can't. You mean they're doing the life of your family. If you try to fight them, if you try to go against the king's order. You just have to let me go with them, please. Princess, let's go to Okay. Just walk, walk on your own. We're not talking. Ah, gaga. This house to stop. This house to stop. Stop. Cross my eyes. If I'm the best, what are you still doing with that woman? You mean, mama? Oh, you mean sexy mama? Whatever. <laughs> Women and jealousy are synonymous. She's, um, she's just a substitute. But you know, I can. This who here has been hiding with a guy who claims to be her boyfriend. How dare you run away from this palace? How dare you? She's no longer wanting to be called a princess. She's not. See, I'm going to demote her to a palace maid. And she will be the only palace maid around here. Because I'm going to sack the other maids. Now. That sounds like an interesting proposition. Let's see how we work her ass out. Now, peace off. I hope there is no problem. Hmm. Oh, can't I have peace in my house again? Can't I take fresh air outside? Since your father has refused to pay for the light bill, I will not pay with my money. Hmm? He doesn't appreciate my efforts in this house now. Yes. Mama, 
I have been thinking about getting married. <laughs> so you have finally decided to accept Chukuka's proposal? Thank God. No, Mama. I am not interested in Chukuka, and that's final. Mama. And Niger came into my head about getting a better man. And I see the opportunity staring at us. What opportunity? Mama. <laughs> you were a member of the Equis cabinet. Hmm? And as such, you have influencing power. So I would want you to talk to the Igwe into taking me in as a wife. <laughs> Just have to calm down, okay? Why? Why would Mama say a thing like that to me? Eh? What is wrong with me marrying the king? He doesn't have a wife. When you say this, she's still so good for you. And who is Mama to make such a decision? Who is she? It's my life. And whoever I want to end up with as a wife should not be contested by anyone. You just have to calm down. Why talk to her? You better talk to her. Talk to her because I don't understand Mama anymore. Eh? Has she not been the one telling us to, 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 to grab any golden opportunity if we say it? Marrying the king is a golden opportunity for me. So why is she telling me to stay away from the king? <coughs> I heard everything you said, Amara. So of all the able-bodied young men in this land, it is that old fool that you prefer. Papa, Papa the king is rich. He will take me to America. Papa, we have so far. Marrying the king will bring us lots of fortune. Will you shut up? Fool! I say you have joined your mother in this path of destruction. Let me warn you, Amara. Stay away from the king. Lest you partake in the destruction that will befall him soon. Papa, Papa leave me alone. Uh -uh, leave me alone. I have my life to live. I know you don't listen to my advice anymore, Amara. But the gods hear my voice. Amara, be careful. Don't worry. Don't bother yourself. I will be fine. But we can't allow you to go through this hot sun. This sun is too hot. Let's help you now, please. The king may come out and see both of you helping me. So don't worry. I'll be fine. Then let him punish us. We can't allow his father to. You know the king is very harsh with his punishment. I do not want to see. Both of you suffering for my sake. It's my body, so let me carry it. Don't worry, I'll be fine. My princess. Please, it's not our fault. The king man so much pressure on us. Okay? It's okay. It's okay, I understand. I understand. It's okay, don't worry. I understand. Hey! I don't give a rat ass what you people are doing there. But I need you to run some errands for me, so get your fat asses in here right now. Yes, yes. Get in here right now. Get in here right now. 
Hey, stop there. 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 Stop Stop there. Stop there. Stop 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 Yes, you are the guy. Your cousin. So you finally remember that she's your cousin. I guess you didn't when you tried to lure her into your bed. Hey! Don't you dare lay your filthy hands on me. So, what, no, they shout for here. Oh. No, they shout. Nice. See this guy. Do you realize you're talking to a prince like this? A prince. I don't see a prince here. All I see is a bloody loofah standing beside me. A woman, Isa. A dog standing beside me. <laughs> what did you just say? Swanky, Papa, who did this to you? It's one boy, though. His name is Chidi. I was on my own, walking on my own. The guy started beating me up. Just like that. Who is that bastard that is not afraid of Big David o, to have raised his oh. hand on my son? Who is that? My son. Your son? You're going to have to choose between me and him because I'm going to deal with him severely. Where are the guards? Just give them the direction of the dickhead's house. Let them take him to the police ASAP. No, Papa. Papa, I want us to bring him. I want you to bring him to the palace here. Let us protect him very well. Whatever. Yeah. Just, just get him incarcerated immediately. Guards, go, go with go, him. Go, 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 go. Fight. You 
You should leave, leave my brother alone. I have to it was the prince that first challenged him to a fight. You. Hey! Okay, wait. At least I'll come with you. We don't have time. The king is sweating. Hold his feet. We don't have time. Hold his feet. I'm not going what? anywhere. This is a What are you stop. trying to do? pressure must stop. Don't give my son. Papa. Hey! Papa. Where is this? Where are you? Papa. Where is this? Where are you? 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 Hey, David. Oh, David. Zeka. Take it easy. William Mayo. I am not going to take it easy. I won't take it easy. I'm going to deal seriously with David. David has touched the tail of a tiger. First, he took my wife as a member of his demented cabinet. Now he has taken my only son into captivity. Okabu, I will not allow this. I won't allow this. I will not. Zeka, I know how you feel. True. But you just have to calm down. Let us look for a better way to go about this. Oh, huh? David. David, you have taken more than you can do. Okay. You have gone to the palace and made all the noise. Shouted all you can. Did he release your son? No! Your son is still locked up. Can you, can you imagine? My son, who doesn't look for anybody's trouble. David has no regards. And my useless wife was there, watching her only son being locked up. David has done more harm to my family. He has done enough harm to my family. And I'm going to bite him so hard. I will bite him so hard. Okay, Zeka. What do you intend to do? I don't know yet. Oh, you see? That is why I asked you to calm down. William Wayo. David will surely get what he deserves. Okay, well, I don't know why the gods have kept silent this while. I don't know. How, how can such a thing be happening to this our peaceful land? Why? Look at where why? Oh my son. Zeka. Okay, cable. Mm. You just have to take this as a man. Hmm? You know go? I will see the chief priest on your behalf this evening. Hmm? Zeka, won't you see me off? Vinye won't come. Stand up, my friend. Stand up. Hey! You feeling the nigga? Are you feeling the nigga? Up a king be David. Big David. Are you feeling the nigga? Are you feeling the nigga? Up a king be David. Big David. Big David. See America, Nata. Oh, if you flow with the change, one If you flow with the change, one nemo. Give a big David a look up a full time. Your Highness, please, I want you to forgive my friend and set him free. Please. He is my friend and the gods are so bring him so much. Your Highness, he does not deserve this punishment. He deserves even more for raising his hand against my son. <laughs> then let me face his punishment while you let him go. How romantic. Juliet coming to plead for Romeo. Well, you already have enough punishment to deal with around here, so request denied. Your Highness, please. It's breaking my heart to see him go through that harsh punishment. Hey! Don't bug me. This you're my uncle. You can do this for me. Get out of my face right now. <laughs> the 
David, I am totally disappointed in you. Papa, I'm King David now. AKA Big David. I don't get to know whatever you call yourself. All I'm saying is that for the past 20 years you've been to, well, I don't, only God knows, I've been taking care of your son. All you did was to keep sending me empty messages. And I went to the US and I wrote you letters. And I wrote a lot of emotions into those letters. I did. What nonsense are you talking about? Letters. All you did was to come back from the US, ascend your lay brother's throne without asking of me. Hey, you took care of a son that belongs to you too. He's your grandson, remember? I can't believe you could easily have forgotten me and even my daughter. Remember, she took a bullet for you when armed robbers attacked your house. Said the words to me since I was brought here. Why? Do you honestly want an answer to that question? Yes, I do. Please talk to me. Chidi, I begged you to stay away from the prince. I begged you and you promised me. You said you were going to do it for me. You promised me. But he wasn't forced to start up a fight. Why didn't you avoid him? Why? Why didn't you ignore him? Now, see where it has landed you. The same thing I've been trying to avoid. I'm sorry, my princess. The humiliation became so much I couldn't, I couldn't tolerate. I'm so sorry. Can we ever come out from this? Can we? I believe we are going to come out of this. I believe in the gods. Choma, what are you doing here? Hmm? What will you get out of this place? Come on, Olivia! What do you want me to do? Hmm? Terrific talk and me. That is exactly what happens to children who do not listen to their mothers. I advised him. Manamba, he took your father's advice. Now who is suffering it? Omoa. Mama, you are a member of the king's cabinet, Mama. So? You have some influence over his decisions. Why didn't you just tell the king to release Chidi, Mama? Why? Because Chidi is not worthy to be saved. I can't believe you're saying this. Believe it, oh. Utoja, believe it, Aina Pussy. I said it. Believe it. The only annoyance in Wenifa is that my enemies will be laughing at me. But that is okay. You know your mother. I can live with that. Mana, he will stay there and suffer what he put himself into. 
This woman is not my mother. Who are you? Hi, Kangwa Sanogi. My name is Chief. Chief, Mrs. Akonna Obuka. Yes, so that is my name, and that is who I am. Are you Chidi not your son? Mm -mm. Chidi is not my son because my son will listen to me. Oh, you're welcome. Mama Biko, just just tell the king to miss Chidi, or, or better still get him chance out to the police station. Chidi is suffering so much. Yeah, rap marka one. Okay, Chidi, Biko, rap marka. Don't you know your way to the palace? Is it well not for everybody? Eh? Go there and talk to him. Or better still, if Olam Nagije, he will listen to you. It's you. You are me to fear for you. Fear for you. Are you mad? Eh? In the your brother. You are next. You are next to fall into the king's trap. And when that happens, Ipokwanam. Ipokwanam. Idiot. Anum Pama. In Apuala. Anum Pama. I forever get that. I want you more. Eh? Oh, yeah, la. I am pussy. Now make a number of idiots. What is that? How long do we continue to wait for the gods to fight our battles for us? Why things are getting out of hand day by day? I suggest we do something. Something like what? Okay, boy. Obu is right. We cannot just fold our hands. We have to do something. Can you imagine him locking up Zeka's son in the palace dungeon for no just cause? In fact, he has no reason, no right to hold the young man captive. I did not say he was wrong. I only asked, what does he suggest we do? Let us go back to the chief priest. But the chief priest has already assured us that the gods will do something. They haven't done anything since then. So I've lost confidence in them. I've lost hope. I don't know what I did to David to warrant this. I've asked David to release my son. He refused. Honestly, if you ask me, I will tell you I don't know what else to do. Nzeka, I want you to calm down. If you don't have any other thing to do, we will have a thousand and one things that we can do. Before we agree on anything, I suggest we consult the chief priest. Okay, boy. This matter is no longer for the chief priest. Our kingdom is on fire. We can't just keep waiting when we have other things to be done. So, what do you have in mind? <sighs> you swank you, so who are those people chanting? Dad, there's a serious problem outside. I went out for a walk with my friends. I saw the youth protesting and threatening to burn down this palace if you do not build those headers. The fuck do you mean the protesting? But this is not the time for fuck this and fuck that. There's a serious rampage going on out there and you need to put a stop to it. Sure, I'm going to put a stop to it. Now go in there get my 0.9 millimeters. Since they won't war with an American citizen, I'm going to give it to them big time. No, Papa. That's not a good idea. The youth are many in number. Then let me call 911. And then send across the CIA, the LAPD, the NYPD. NYPD, what that? Papa! Before those people get down here, they would have burned this palace down! Someone Come on, for the sake of peace! Hey, relax, son. There's nobody getting paranoid. I'm here to protect you. Papa, please. Please. For the sake of peace. Just do what I said, please. 
go in there and get the guts to release those sons of bitches. And I don't want to see their faces no more. Yesterday, the youths protested that I should release some old punks I had incarcerated. Now, I decided to oblige them for the sake of peace. But I was ready to give them war if my son hadn't pleaded on their behalf. Now, I believe some of those old punks are your husbands. I want you to go home and caution them. Because Big Davido will brook no further harassment and nonsense. You got that? Yes, yes, yes they do. do. Good. I was living happily in the United States when they invited me here to come and rule over them. They should allow me to rule them my way. Does anyone have a problem with that? No. Good. Oh, my king. I see that um, you are not happy. I think um, some kisses would just be fine with you think. So much. How do you know I will need this? Hmm? Sorry. Please, there's something I want to ask of you. How dare you call me suffering? Haven't I warned you? I've warned you. It's Swanky! Swanky, okay? Okay. Swanky, I'm sorry. There's something I need to ask of you. Go on and make it brief. I want you to help me beg your father to release my friend for me. Let me beg him to release Chidi for me, please. I should beg my father to release your, your, your Chidi for you? Oh my god. Why didn't I know she was going to say this shit? So, Swanky, sorry. My friend is suffering. Chidi is suffering. I love him so much. He was so for sick. Please release him for me, please. Give me one reason I should do that for you. What have I ever asked of you that you did for me? What? So, since you came back, I've been doing everything you asked of me. Hmm. Everything. <laughs> You've forgotten how you made your father banish me from this land? You were trying to rape me. Have you forgotten? you not to let anyone know but in your wickedness you screamed and your father punished me from this land <laughs> it is my world i beg you in the name of god i love chidi so much <laughs> just let him out please do this for me please you still prefer him to me right you are my cousin Please tell me why these pot-bellied, punk-ass douchebags are still in power? When there are young niggas like me who could rule this country better? Oh, I miss the New York Times. That's what I should be reading, not this mumbo jumbo piece of crap. Greetings, your highness. Oh, hi. Who do we have here? My name is Amara. Amara. What a befitting name for such a quintessential looking 
young lady. Tell me you're not from this village. My king, I am from this village. Oh, come on. So how come I have not seen such an adorable figure like yours since I got back? Or you've not been around, huh? I've been around, Your Highness. This is my first time of beholding such an adorable figure. You're welcome to my palace. Thank you. You can call me Big Davido. Big Davido? That's my girl. What can I do for you? My king, I'm here to tell you what an amazing king you are. And I'm also tell you that I am happy to have you as my king. Wow. This is the first time I'm hearing this from such a young woman. I'm so, so blushing. Come here. Thank, Thank you. you for your compliment. No, it's nothing, my king. Look, I am willing to offer you myself as a sign of my appreciation. Tell me I'm not dreaming. You are not dreaming, my king. Wow. Um, come with me to my private quarters. Let's see what you got. Good evening. That is not the answer to my question. I don't know the reason for that question. I'm coming from an outing. I can see you're out of your mind. Mama, I am not ready for your trouble this evening. Please, how can you ask a grown-up like me where I'm coming from? Oh, you're a grown-up. You are a grown-up. If you are grown up now, then you should be in your own house. Where no one will ask you where you are going or where you are coming from. Marachi, before I come free, I want to know where you are coming from. Let me ask you, Mama. Why are you so concerned about where I'm coming from? I'll see if you care. Meaning? Meaning that I owe you no explanation anymore on how I run my life. Because it's obvious you don't care about my welfare. Then you will leave my house because I will have no insolent child under the same roof. Do you understand me? Come on, chase me away. Let me see. What did you say? What is going on in this house? Would you people allow me to unrest in my house? Eh? One had to stay away from my offense. One how? No, one is shut, shut up! Do you realize it is your mother you are talking to? No! Let her wind her mouth. But I will show you that no one eats my ear. No one eats Nama's ear. Have you seen what she has done? Hey. I will show you. I will deal with you messlessly in this house. All right. We will see. Uh, uh, Nemo. Eh? Uh, Biko. Uh, you will get the knock Please, let's go inside. I should go inside. Yeah. I should go inside. Mouthpiece of the gods. We thought we were doing the right thing. By confronting a madman like Devi, why didn't you tell me before going to him? Wise one. I'm sorry. 
very sorry. I was the one that advised him not to bother you. Because uh, we thought we could handle David on our own. Yeah. So I'm very sorry, please forgive me. That's the right thing to do. I told you that the gods are aware of the situation and they will do something about it. And you went ahead to fight for the gods. Please, wise man. Please, we are very sorry. We acted out of anger. Mm -hmm. Forgive us. We will never do it again, please. The gods are not deaf to your supplication or blind to your suffering. I urge you once again, be patient with the gods. We will. We will be patient, please. Thank you, one piece of the gods. Thank you. I will so far so good this man has been released. Good day, sir. Good day, sir. How may I help you, sir? Uh, yes, I'm here to see my son. Name? Chido Buka. The boy from the... Oh, oh, oh. Father. Well, I'm sorry, sir. We can't see him. How do you mean by uh, I can't see him? Like I said, you can't see him. You don't accept him. I demand to see my son and I have the right to see my son. Oh, God, stop shouting at me now. You can't you see can't him. You can't see him, sir. I said I want to see my son. Sir, there is a standing order you can see him. Which are standing order? That I can't see my son? What is going on here? What's going on? Sir, um, he said he wants to see his son. His son? Um, Who is his son? Chido Buka, Chido Buka. He was moved from palace to this place. Oh, oh, oh. The one that was moved from palace to this place? Yes. Okay, I'm sorry, sir. There is an order from APS authority. Not allowing you to see anybody for now. I don't know. That I can't see my son. Is he alive? Does he eat? Your son is alive. Like I said, there is an order from a pest authority not to allow him to see anybody for now. Good day. I need to be in my office. Constable, take your that. Please, I want to see my son. Okay? I think we are done with you. You can leave. I said I want to see my son. I said I can go. Go where? Hello, sir. You will arrive to the police station. And you can be arrested for shouting. For what? Please take I don't have the right to see my son. I got gone now. Papa, I don't understand why they refuse you to see children. They said the other was from Abu. Why would David do this to my son? What has he done to him? I have to go to the palace. I need to go and see Chidi. No, please, my daughter, don't. No, 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 Papa. I need to know the crime that Chidi has committed that deserves court punishment. I must go to the palace. Oh, they can now have a good time. Oh, they forget finance. That man is evil. He can even rape you. So please don't. Let us wait and uh... watch my brother die. Ah, ah, ah. Yeah? Forget okay. you. Hey, you, you've not had your bag. I will not go into the market again. I am so ashamed of you. Mama, you're talking about going to the market when your only son is in the police net suffering. I couldn't even ask of his well-being. Mama, why are you this wicked and heartless? I don't want to talk. If you're not going to the market with me, because he's there, we won't eat again. Okay? Eh? What do you want me to do? No, no, no. What do you want me to do? Am I the police commissioner or the inspector general of police? Okay, the Dunka. Eh? Akonna. No, no. Chief Mrs. Akonna always address me properly. Okay, Nano. Okay, Thank you. We are talking of our only son here. I know. And you couldn't talk to your favorite king. Hmm? Hmm? I'm glad you know. He is my favorite and my king. So I cannot disturb him with trivial matters like that. You know what I mean? Since you're not going, can 
Kok pagi doko? Anya, 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 his son has suffered so much in the hands of that madman called David. <laughs> Big David, though, he called himself. I even heard that uh, he has moved the boy from the palace to the police station now. Yes, you are right. He has moved the boy. And when Isaac visited the police station, they stopped him from seeing his son. Eh? Eh? Wonder shall never end. <gasps> Who will believe that David could be that wicked and monstrous just because the boy is in love with the princess? Hmm. Is it now a crime to love? I'm asking you. That was because David had eyes on that girl. That is the reason. You know, and I just pray that the gods intervene before that madman sleep with his own knees. Abomination has become rife in this town. Hey. And hey. if. Hey. Come. Come. Wait, wait. Come. Come on. Come on. Hey, hey, wait. Come on, get it. Yeah. Come here. Where you are wrong, bro? <laughs> I must not speak no to the world. I overheard you. Talking about my father, the king, and I. Hello! Uh, 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 are we out of our minds? Uh, uh. How can we gossip about the king? We were just discussing about the delay. <laughs> oh, the rainfall. Shut you know, up, because of the rain famine maker. season. No, no, just, so you be rainmaker. How can we discuss it? Shut up! Shut up! As a rainmaker. Hold up! Hold up! Hold up! Hold up! As a rainmaker. I go go you down. I don't like your eyes. Please go down. Come on, Mr. Blood. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Pull it all down! Pull it! 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 Pull it!
You've not told me why you've been acting this way since you came back from the palace. Oh, what is the problem? Or is the king dead? Mama, please. I had a spoiled time with my friends today. I don't want you to spoil my mood. Please. You had a swell time with the king. Hmm? You shameless whore. Shameless whore! With the king? Shameless prostitute. <laughs> Mama, but please, Nasha, I'll finally grab the key. My sister, I couldn't do it again now. Eh? Look, I have to be the next queen of Ogunofia Kingdom. You mean Ria? Look at me. Look at this in Kapia. You have the boldness to admit to that shameful act in front of me. Eh, hey, much? Look, if you were not my mother, I would have said that you were mad. Did you just insult me? Amachi, did you just insult me? Oh, no, no. What's up, nigga? Bitch, you a dude, you nigga. What's up, nigga? What's up, nigga? What's up, nigga? Bitch, you a dude, you nigga. Share you don't the feel the nigga. I hope you the feel the nigga. I'm fucking the David, big David. Are you feeling the nigga? Are you feeling the nigga? I'm fucking the David, big David. Share you don't the feel the nigga. I hope you the feel the nigga. I'm fucking the David, big David. Are you feeling the nigga? Are you feeling the nigga? I'm fucking the David, big David. Share you don't the feel the nigga. I hope you the feel. My good delicious mama. <laughs> I like the way you call me. <laughs> You're so more than caring, I must commend you. You mean I'm the best? You're more than the best. Um, and I'm happy you're spending this weekend with me. <laughs> Let me feed you. Uh, hmm. hmm. My handsome king, mm -hmm. you've not said anything about what I told you. Um, remind me. About my son. He, he has been tortured enough. Please, I want him out. Oh, you mean the one who assaulted my boy? Um. Let me think seriously about it and um, I'll get permission from my boy. And, um, Please, I want him out. Though I didn't like him being against you, but he's still my blood. Please. All right, my angel. Anything for you. Thank you. Mm. Hey, one more thing, my handsome king. Yep. There's something I've been meaning to tell you, but I don't know how you take it. What is it? It's about Norma. What about her? There's this rumor that has been making rounds that She's planning with her husband to to dethrone you. <laughs> no, 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 I don't believe it. I mean, that woman is so into me and... Um, no, 
I don't believe any crap of what you just said. No. She can't do that. I know you will not believe me. But my handsome king, I want you to be careful. Remember, her husband was the owner before you removed him. They are still waging a serious but silent war against you. What's the matter? Dad, I'm, What's the matter? I'm broke. You? Are you kidding me? No. I'm serious. Swanky, I gave you a hundred grand last week. Come on, Dad. I have some unforeseen expenses that I need the money for. Listen, young man, you got to take it easy with your spending. Dad doesn't own a bank, remember? Yes, I remember. But you are the one that said that your cargo is coming in a week's time. Yeah, it'll be here in 30 days. But until then, you have to go easy on your spending. Please, please. What is it? Oh, shut up. Speak, what is it? The princess leaked out of the palace. I've searched for her all over. She's nowhere to be found. What? So you and the other guy and this palace, the princess sneaked out from this palace. You didn't know. You didn't know. Listen, let me tell you something. I'm going to give you 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Bring her back to this palace. Do you understand? Come on, get out from this place. Hey, come. Hey, hey. Come, take this way. Take this way. Swanky, I'm going to give you a check. Hmm? Is that okay? But from now on, you have to go easy on your spending. Is that clear? Okay, Dad. Thank you, Dad. Dad. That's how we go. That's it. <laughs> I wish you weren't leaving already. <laughs> You want me to stay the night? I want you to stay forever. <laughs> Hell. Mm. You know what? Why don't you go to my father's house, pay my bride powers, mm -hmm. and return the one that has been paid by my current husband? I could actually take you up on that, you know? <laughs> But hey, there's something I want to ask you. You ask me a lot of questions in the bedroom now. This, this one is very important. Okay. I have been receiving a lot of disturbing reports about some people who are plotting against me. Hmm. I know I have a lot of friends and you happen to be one of the closest, so I ask. Is there anything you're keeping from me? No, my king. You will be the first that I will tell if I hear of any plan against you. So, I still enjoy your trust and support? Always, my king. Always, now. Mm? Good, good, good. Mm? So, when next time I see you? Before that, um, I have this thing that is troubling my mind. Has anybody been talking to you about me? No, nobody. I just get information from a lot of groups of people, but you're still my number one. <laughs> um, Do I have any lipstick on you? No. <laughs> um, okay. Um, you want to see me? Like yesterday. No, ma. You're ready. 
Yes, sir. Uh, what do you mean? We are not at all. There is love in sharing. <laughs> Did you get to see the laborers today? Yes. The workers will start working two days' time. Oh, that's wonderful. I hear you went to the palace. Yes, so hmm. I went to the palace today to see the eagle concerning the forthcoming of Fala Festival. Mm. Mm. Hey, Mama, you're a pathological liar. You're coming back from a meeting in GT. Amarach, are you alright? Wanya, Kukenezioku, tell Papa the truth. Tell him the truth of what you went to do at the palace. Tell him. Amarachi, what has come over you? Papa, Amarachi is saying the truth. Let Mama tell us what she went to do at the palace. You will not shut your mouth. Don't worry. Let me save her the stress of explaining. Papa, I caught your so-called wife today at the palace, kissing and caressing the king. Hey! hey! Hmm. Amarachi. Hello. Amarachi, um, are you all right? Are you mad? Um, Everybody knows, the ground I'm standing on knows that I went to the palace to discuss the Ophala festival with Igwe. Ophala festival indeed. Mama, you're a terrible liar. Yes, you are. Hey, who could have believed you stood this low? No, me, Mama. You better know what you know. Mama, I'm ashamed of you. Hey. That was why she was against you having anything to do with the king. One name Mama, I'm so disappointed. Hey. Will you shut up? You can don't mind them, yeah? Mama. Papa. So this is what you do, eh? You can don't mind them. Mama, I love you. So this is what you're going to do with the Igwe at the palace. That's a lie. Hey, Mama, you, not enough you have killed me. Papa, what is that? I don't like this thing that you're doing, you know, eh? Mama is here enjoying herself while you're here dying. Shut up! But that's the truth. Stop talking nonsense. Mama, that's the truth now. That's not the truth. Shut up, John. Honey, don't mind okay, them. Eh? You don't mind them. Don't mind them. No, you know it's a lie. Mama, you are filthy. You know I love you. Guys. I don't know what is wrong with my father. Man, he's been stingy. Of late, he doesn't want to give me money anymore. He said that I spend money too much. I don't know why. why. Why would he say you're spending too much money? Doesn't he spend much too? Come on, <laughs> he has six women he's maintaining, and you don't even have one. I have an idea, Swanky. Why not kill the old man and take over the throne? Yeah, are you mad? Obin, are you mad? If you're not my friend, I'm not a kid right now. Why would you give him the such a suggestion? Are you okay? No, huh? The old man doesn't bring money anymore. What can you hit us him? What's wrong? That was an honest suggestion, I know that. You too? Yeah. How dare you? But it's true. For crying out loud, Swanky, you just told us that your, your father is being too stingy about you. That means somebody's corrupting his mind towards you. Huh? And the way things are going on now, he might stop giving you money. Oh. Eh? Check in here now. He will not. Oh. He will not. Thank you. Listen. Hold on. Don't tell me you bought that idea. No, I don't. Okay. But if your dad is going to be an obstacle, then you have to take good care of him. That's it. That's it. Becoming the next king of Obinofa Kingdom. It's not a bad idea. So, that is it now. Mm -hmm. Inugonia. Kill the man, man. Guys, guys let's be spending this money. I like this life, oh. this new clothes. I like it very well. Uh -uh. Hey, what do you think you're up to? What do you think you're up to? I won't ask you. No, my people, I don't have your time. I won't ever demand that. It's okay. This. Did you just touch me? I would, I, I would just touch you again. Hey, hey, hey. Listen, I have tolerated you enough. You see, but lying against me to Big Davido is the height of it. 
You will see fire. Oh. Me the guest here now. I will tear you into pieces and take your remains to your husband. No, no, no. Yes. Okay. Yes. What do you think you can even do? Me, 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 You know my handsome king, I told you that Norma is evil. I don't trust that woman. So I, I I started trailing her. I even had to pay some people to to spy on her and eavesdrop on all her conversations. Oh, come on, was that really necessary? I told you I would verify from her, which I did, and it turned out she's innocent. Hey, that's not true. My king, that is not true. Wait now, let me finish. Just yesterday, I saw her, her husband, and some elders having a conversation. I confronted her after the meeting and I asked her what happened, what they were talking about. And she, I don't know why she trusted me though, and she said that um, they were plotting on how to dethrone you so that her husband will become the Igwe. <laughs> That's impossible. Uh -huh. The same thing I told her. She even told me that um, she she has this um, secret that no one knows about. That she, she's the only one that knows the real reason you came back from abroad. What did you just say? Uh -huh. Are you feeling the nigga? Up a king, the David. Big David. Are you feeling the nigga? Are you feeling the nigga? Up a king, the David. Big David. Big David. Oh, see America, Nata. Yeah. Oh, see, see, that's in Nata. Yeah. Oh. If you play with the change, you want no more. In a big David, look about full time. That's the buffalo. I have Stay the hell away from me. Where is your mother? Where is she? Hey! Welcome, my king. Hey! Hold it right there. Bundle her to the palace dungeon. Right hey! Now. See, he has arrested my my uh, your mother. Do you know what she has committed? Do you know? But she's my wife. Your wife, indeed. A wife that sleeps around. Eh? Biko, 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 go and do something useful with your time. Amara, do you know you're heartless? She's my. Eh? David, Papa, go inside. Don't worry about Mama. Don't worry. No, now leave Papa now. Take her to the dungeon. <laughs> My handsome king. Sit down, sit down. Thank you. <laughs> My handsome king. Now you have every reason to thank me. <laughs> thank you. So who else knows about this? She said she did not tell anyone that she would have told somebody if you had refused to step down. But now that she's in chains, I don't think she'll have that kind of opportunity again. Good. So you're the only other person who knows about this? Yes, my handsome king. And your secret is safe with me. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> my handsome king. Why are you calling them? You know, it's a good thing you've given me this assurance. Now all my fears are doused, knowing that the only two people who know the real reason why I returned from the United States are in the dungeon. 
take her to the dungeon. No, no, no. Hey, my handsome king, you're my man. Take you, her to the you dungeon. You promised to take me to LA. What the fuck? Why? Looks like somebody just got trapped in the trap. The set. <laughs> you, you bad luck. You are the one that brought bad luck to yourself. Hmm? Just look at, look at what you have done, all in your quest to punish Noma. <laughs> look at where it has gotten you. <laughs> you did not scare the king, did you? You are a loser. You made me lose the king. Just look at you. Hmm? You spent all your energy just to feed the king false information about me. <laughs> what a wasted effort! What a wasted effort! Oh, no, don't laugh into my ears! Don't, don't laugh into my ears! Okay. I will not just laugh into your ears, I will laugh into your nostril. Do you know why I'm laughing? I'm sure you don't have an idea why I am laughing. I am laughing to suppress my anger at a devil like you. You were feeding the king false lies, false information because of your wicked ambition to become queen. I want you to stay off the king. I want you to come back. Okay. Hey! He has unleashed his wickedness on me again. Uh, again, call me. What happened? My wife. My wife went to the palace this morning. He locked her up. Nobody told me what she did. That's the worst part of it. Muzika, take it easy. Hmm? It is not a matter of taking it easy. No, I came to report to you so that we call the elders. This madness has to stop today. Today, you know. Nzeka, I said take it easy. David arrested my wife too. Huh? Oh. Sorry. Oh no, this is getting out of hand. We need to organize the youth. Because we can no longer wait for the gods. Yes. If you ask me, that demented tyrant must leave that throne today. If you ask me, oh, I prefer for my wife to remain in the palace dungeon. Huh? Mm. Oh no. Emukwani. Why would you say a thing like that? If you didn't marry Rika, I discovered recently that my wife has been having a secret relationship with the king. Oh. Hey, huh? So it's true. He, my wife does same. Even my daughter got her. But I never wanted to believe it. Oh. Hey. You had better believe it, my brother. These women are something else. And I don't think I want to waste my time going to protest for their release. Mbam. Hey. What am I going to say? Hi! You know why I should have listened to my brothers? They advised me against marrying that demon. 
My own wife was betrothed to me from childhood. Hi. Anyway, I'm glad she's out of my life now. Hi. Biko, can I you want want to to see? Let's talk about something else. Oh, you want some snuff? I can not snuff for God, maybe. Hi! Baby mm. finger. This may just be the perfect time to end this man. Take over. What? He said his cargo will be coming in soon. I You're joking, right? Of course I'm serious. I mean, she's our mother no matter what. And knowing too well that she's suffering there is so unfair of us. Oh, <laughs> So everything Mama did, you still want her back to this house? A woman that deprived me from getting married to the king. Oh, Biko. Biko. I don't want to get angry this afternoon. Please. Amara, oh, I know exactly what Mama did. And I know it's very wrong. But keeping her at the dungeon, it's not just the best way. What do you want me to do? Eh? Am I the one that kept her there? But you and that person are friends. You never can tell. He might still accept you back. And you plead with him to release Mama. Eh? Oh. You want me to go and beg the king to release her? Mm -hmm. Eh? And you think the king will not be angry and throw me in there as well? Oyechi, if you want Mama out of that place, go there and beg. Hmm? I don't want to discuss this anymore. I don't. Amara, it's not fair. She's our mother. Who, who does not know she's that? She's our mother. And who does not know that she's our mother? I know. But a mother who deprived her daughter from getting married to the king is not going to be called a mother. So she got what she deserved. Biko, Biko. Ekuchakwa Munkem. Ekuchakwa Munkem. Ekuchakwa Munkem. It's not good though. She's our mother. She's our mother. Biko, guys, I know you're hungry. That's that. My friends, my friends. Yes, madam, how can I help you? It's been long if you stayed in my shop. See, um, see, madam. It's Swanky. My name is Swanky. Okay? Okay. Swanky. It's been long if you stayed in my shop. I've been expecting you. And I sell all type of bush meats. And also... Madam, please, please. Save those things for your customers, okay? Yeah. Then you are one of them. My old customer. Well, I am not interested in whatever shit you're selling, okay? Please stop, bro. Oh, sorry, Swanky. 
Don't do this to me. I know you are still unhappy over the embarrassment I gave you then. But I thought I have apologized enough. Please, I'm sorry. Say the apology to yourself. See, I will come to your store or your bar anytime I feel like. Do you understand? What have I come in this weekend? Enough. You promised to give you discounts. Enough of all this. Oh, God. I have money to buy you and your entire bar. I will pay for anything I buy from the bar, okay? So I will come at any time I feel like. I know. Hmm? Come, my friends, please. Come, my love. I promise to give you everything. Anything? Are you sure? Don't worry, I'll come to your bar. That's my friend. I'm expecting you. Where are you? Where are you? Hey! Hello, what? Where Papa! Papa! Hey! Yeah, Papa! Yes, Papa. All this up. Bia, Papa. So, Puru. Ever since your father became king, you've never cared to know, to come to know whether I'm alive. Of course, Papa. You are alive. Or are you planning to die anytime soon? No. But I have a grandson who does not care. And also an in-law who is a big disgrace. Papa, what is it again? Get it home. Eh? Papa, I came to see you. At the same time, I brought some food stuff for you. Instead of you to be to, to, to appreciate it. You are here complaining. What is it? I don't think I'm interested in all that food stuff or whatever because that is not my main concern now. I'm above all that. I know what I've been through training you, clothing you, and all that. And you think this can, you want to insult me with this type of stuff? Oh, 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 or do you want to go? Well, if you so desire, you may leave. If you care to. If I don't desire, yes, that means that, you see, this old age has come to your brain that you don't think threats. In a church of woman. Papa, let me tell you something, my prince. Yes, I'm a prince. I do not beg. If you don't want, I will go. Then go. Go and don't come here again. Go, don't come here again. You, you, oh, you want to intimidate me with these words? Hey, prince, Prince! Oh, when you found me, what up? Oh, 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 what up? My king, I'm here for you. Am I dreaming? No, you're not. This is for real. You're not dreaming.
I know this forest will be good for you, for that faction of yours. Isn't it? You see, but where does it stop? I think this land is going to be very good for my factory. <laughs> but where does it stop? Hey, you have an eh? Yes. You see, you can pass through this place. Okay. Go down. Mm -hmm. When you get to a river, that is the stop of the land. Okay? Yeah. That is where the land stops. Okay? You say, Bahana. Awo, Narisha, Lai, Akamogu. That is all right. Well, it's all right. right. Yes, okay. yes, yes. It's I'm a very fine place. <laughs> it's a nice place. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, uh, I didn't no, understand I that. Boy. It can also help you, you know, in getting this work done. It can help you as a good land. One minute, please. One minute, please. Hello. 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 Oh, please, just give me ten minutes. I, I think I will get back to you, please. Ten minutes. Just ten minutes. Just ten minutes. That is all right. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, my dear. <laughs> yeah. So you see, you see, um, I I have so many boys in my company, and I, 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 so I don't need any external hand at all. But but if you have to stay put, right, or hang around, and whenever I need you, I will say. Oh, Give us the money. I will work again. Oh, no, no. I must give you the money. I am, I am so glad about it. It is a very good life. All my boys are ready to... to, 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 to. His boys are ready to... That's all right. That is all right. That is all right. Once, 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 once we have the money, our boy is yours. You said you are the prince of this Yes, I am the prince of this land. Prince Swanky. And my father, King David, which is the king of this kingdom, the only swagalicious king in this kingdom. The only American this king. This forest belongs to him. Mm. <laughs> that is lovely. Yemen, you be Hello, boy, sir. Right. You talk about a bucket and a cargo of the egg. Very simple. Right. Yemen, right. Very simple. This is good. <laughs> very good. Very big. Extensive. Very big. <laughs> <laughs> so, my dear, it's a deal. <laughs> it is a deal. <laughs> I want to. I want to. I love this. I love this. I go to it. Love, 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 love. What is actually? I think I can go one mark. I mean, things are getting worse today. But what can we do? Okay, we can get make one. Too high. David, hey, that's a phobia, Nasha. The worst has happened. We are doomed. Eh? Mobi, okay, what happened? That abomination of a boy has committed further abomination. In fact, this time around, we went to the extreme. Man. Say something. What happened? Man. What did he do? He has sold our evil forest. Eh? Ah, well. Man. Our fear ah. our has been sold. Ah, well. Eh. Eh. Sold as in, as in for money? Yes. Hey. Hey. I saw the man that bought it with a group of laborers going there to set up a factory. Hey. Hey. Our hey. sacred hey. land has been sold to a total stranger. Hey. It, this cannot happen. Hey. The chief priest was here this. Hey! I know you know hey. you know you know you know this hey. man and his son has finished up. Hey. We cannot no no. The they chief priest must hear this. Hmm. We must tell let us go. Hey. Be on the kind. Hey. Let us go. What are you doing? Let's go. And David. I'm on my The mouth is enough. Hey! Hey! Oh when a snake refuses to show his venom Children will mistake that snake for a rope. Ghosts of our ancestors, arise. Arise and fight for your people. Do not be silent for so long. 
because the wicked will continue to bask in their victory. Arise! 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 It's good news. We can no longer continue to wait in vain. Exactly. If we don't do something now, that madman David and his son may sell us all and our households. There is no cause for alarm. The mighty hand of justice sent by God is here. Uh. Hey. Please, please, my father. Please, I'm sorry. Please, I'm sorry. No! Uh, okay. The mighty hand. Please, please oh, forgive me. I will be a young man. Please, please. Ah! I will confess. So speak on. I will speak. Mm -hmm. <laughs> My elders, please forgive me. I'm sorry. So, so, you killed the king. You are not from this village. So, who sent you and why? From me. I'm from Mama village. Hey. I was sent by. Prince to do which prince? Which prince? So
Come on, man. Big David O. Papa, forget this Big David O thing. Papa, can't you hear the voice? Can't you hear? What is it? The youth are angry. They are protesting. They want you out of the throne. Oh, Christ, not again. These youths, the sons of bitches, I'm going to kick their asses. Yes, but kick their ass now. We're going to crush them. I crush them? But let's crush them now. Let's kick their asses now. Papa, you said you have 9 mm. Get it. Come bring it. Let us kill them. Let's shoot them all. Papa, come on. We have to do this thing right now. We have to protect this strong. That's right. Papa, let me tell you something. When your blood brother banished me from this land, I couldn't forgive him. So I sent someone to kill him. You what? You killed my brother? Yes, Papa. Christ. I'm sorry, Biko. No, 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 Biko. Please forgive me. I know I'm not worthy to be called a wife and a mother. Forgive me, Biko. No. My quest for power led me into making wrong choices. Hey. Everybody makes mistakes at some point. All he needs to do is go to the police station and apologize to Chidi. He was not always an apology. Hey. Hey. Because I'm sorry. Forgive me, my husband, please. Forgive me, because no, 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 Amarachi, where are you going? Please come back. No, Papa. Leave me alone. I cannot forgive her. How can I forgive a woman who has who doesn't want my progress? A woman who has always been against my move. How? Amarachi won because I'm I'm sorry. Please find it in your heart to forgive me. It was the devil's handwork. I beg you. Biko. You know? Because you're not going to be I'm you. Forgive her. For my sake. Papa. Sometimes I wonder the kind of person you are. How can you be begging for a woman who cheated on you? How can both of you be listening to this woman? How? Because you're... Please, let's forgive her. At least she has sincerely apologized. Because, oh. Amarachi, love covered a multitude of sin. Because, find it in your heart to forgive me. I'm sorry. I'm ashamed of myself and all the actions that I did. Because, go Amio, see, I have forgiven her. Hmm? Forgive her too now. Amio. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah. 
My people, today is a historic day in the history of Obinopia Kingdom. Two years ago, we were ruled by a mad and demented king who subjected us to a lot of hardships and adversity. But today, here in our midst, we have a man who is loved by many. A man worthy to be king. A man who is the husband of our princess. And tradition dictates that the husband of our princess shall be king. Therefore, my people, join me as I crown our own dear son, the one and only Chidi Obuka, as the Ezenkili one of Open Up Your Kingdom. <laughs> Jay, that's my son. Jay, and that's Jay. my son. <laughs> you all, elders of Obinofia, today marks a new dawn in this community. The days of evil are over. It's a new dawn. This is a new era. I enjoy peace in this community. Thank you very much. Open up your well. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Where's one? Yeah. 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 I thank the gods for returning peace in Open up here. Our new king, may you live forever. Baba so anki, so anki, Baba so anki, so anki, give me a jugger, Baba so anki. Sub 
Sapolichukul, Sapolan Nagi Nan Nagi, Sapolichukul, Sapolan Namutalan Nagi, Sapolichukul, Sapopara, Obodogi, Makanga Puparo, Sano, one and forty day. What are you children, Susu, Siana, Kadiko, Desina? Ewanemmo, <laughs>